Panic attack breathing techniques to help you relax and this includes two simple breathing exercises. Hi it's John here from Mindset Universe and in this video I'm going to share two super easy breathing techniques that can help you relax when you're having or you've had a panic attack. Now these are super simple to give a try so watch the video all the way through to make sure those panic attacks go where they belong and that is away from you. And very quickly to be the first to see all my latest videos make sure you subscribe to the channel and also hit the bell notification. Now there's some fantastic content and also some free guides coming your way so don't take the chance of missing out. And by the way, this video has been created from inspiration in the excellent Panic Prevention Program. Now you can find out more details through the link in the description below the video if you're interested. So what are these panic attack breathing techniques? Tip one is called square breathing. Now this is also known as box breathing and is a technique that is super effective in reducing stress stopping anxiety and helping with panic attacks. So how do you do it? Well, step one is to get ready. And this is to try and make sure you are in a stress-free and quiet environment, if that is possible. Uh, you can sit upright in a comfortable chair, or you can even sit on the floor using a cushion, but make sure your back is against the wall and you are sitting up straight. Now, I found that this can also work standing up, but that might just be me. Then keep your hands relaxed or by your side and go on to the next step. Step two of this tip is to slowly exhale. What you want to do is you need to exhale through your mouth and focus on the intention of getting all the oxygen out of your lungs. On to step three, and this is where you slowly inhale. You can do this to the count of four. Inhale slowly and deeply through your nose. And again, you wanna focus on completely filling this time your lungs with oxygen. On to step four, and here you wanna hold your breath for the count of four, and then move on to step five, and that is to exhale again through your mouth to the count of, you've got it, Four. Now focus again on expelling all the oxygen from your lungs like you did at the beginning. And finally, hold your breath for another count of four and repeat the process as many times as you like until you feel calm and relaxed again. Now there is plenty of scientific evidence to back up this technique, like the fact it allows CO2 to build up in the blood, which has the effect of lowering blood pressure, also regulating temperature, and it encourages a sense of calm in your body. But let's not talk about that, it just simply works. So give it a try and see how you feel. On to tip two, and this is a technique called belly breathing. This is another breathing tip you can try to help reduce and even stop anxiety and panic attacks. Again, this technique is in steps and, and step one is to place one hand just above your belt line and the other hand you put it on your chest right over the breastbone. Your hands here, they, they will tell you what part of your body and what muscles you are using to breathe. With your hands in place, you go on to step two and now you will open your mouth and gently sigh. Now the point of the sigh is that you don't want to completely empty your lungs in this breathing exercise. You just want to relax upper body muscles. Onto step three, you pause for a few seconds with your mouth closed. And then in step four, with your mouth closed, you inhale slowly through your nose whilst pushing your stomach out. You want to inhale as much air as possible without using any upper body movements. You just want to use your stomach for this exercise. Then when you finish the inhale, you stop and you go to step five. You now want to pause for a time that is comfortable for you. Now, of course, everyone has different lung capacity, but I find that a count of five really works for me. So give it a go and adjust the timing if required. You then go into step six and now you open your mouth and exhale by pulling your belly in and then repeat the whole process as many times as you need and feel comfortable doing so. 
Now please note that you may need to breathe more slowly than usual to stop feeling lightheaded. So just go with your body and follow the signals. So that's two panic attack breathing techniques that you can try to relieve the symptoms of panic and anxiety attacks. By the way, these are also great when you just want to find some time for yourself, relax and leave the world far, far behind. Now, I'd love to know if any of these work for you or maybe you've got another way to reduce and stop panic attacks. And as always, sharing is caring, so let everyone know in the comments. Thanks for watching and try not to worry when you don't have to.